Hello YouTube, Let Playmaker here for, well Let Playmaker 1073 is here for part one of Let, well, it's going to be a playthrough, but it's going to be an attempted 100% run of The Legend of Zelda, Majors or Majora's Mask, I can't say it properly, I call it Majors Mask, so if it's wrong, then put up with it. I've always called it Majors Mask, because it looks like Majors Mask, but I'm probably the blah 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 with the, uh, etc. Ugh. Ah, do you know what? Just forget it. Hold on, isn't some kind of cutscene happen here? Ah, you know what? Forget it. <laughs> Erase this file. Yes. I warn you, this part's going to be kind of long because this part is going to be completely um, from beginning to well, from the part where we. Right, like, you'll you'll understand. Stupid joystick. In the land of Hyrule, there is echoes. Of Echoes of a legend. The, 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 I can't say it quick enough, sorry. Well, this is basically a game that is just straight after Ocarina of Time. It says there, a battle once waged across time. So it's exactly the same. This is the same link that fought Ganon, Ganondorf as the hero of time. Sorry you can't exactly read the writing that well because it's a little fuzzed up. But that's just the way how my camera rolls for like a couple of seconds when a picture shows. But if you have trouble, all you have to do is pause it. There's Link and a Pony. And two fairies, a white and black, light and darkness. No, that was just a random saying, because one was light and one was dark. You two fair, you two fairies did great. I wonder if he has anything good on him, huh? This guy? Well, that shouldn't be a problem. Pretty ocarina. Hey, skull kid, let me touch it. I want to see it. What I want to see. Ah, screw it. I don't want to talk. Sorry. I know first part. I don't feel like it. <laughs> they couldn't break it even if they tried. That's the ocarina of time. It's a legendary item. Like he'd fall for that. <laughs> Jumps onto his leg. Shoved off. Ah, 
I have to go and get back my horse. Oh, in case you're wondering, this area here, don't bother wondering about this area because you're never going to return. This is a one time only. I like the way how Link jumps in this game. It's truly epicness compared to Ocarina of Time in jumping. It can also jump long, yeah, longer as well. But I still have to say, Ocarina of Time has to be one of my absolute favourite Zelda games. Whoa, what's up with all the freaky pictures? Link's gone sick. Link's been taking drugs. What the hell? Well, no duh, it's a wild horse. You cheeky son of a skull kid. Well, no duh, you stole my horse. Is that any thought to get rid of it? You're the fool, not me. Ugh, creepy. <laughs> but if I thought that was creepy, this is even creepier. Whoa, what's with all the Deku scrubs? Whoa, now that's B. What the hell? I've been turning to a Deku scrub. No! Screw you. I'll get you. Aren't you polite? Sis? So this fairy here is a girl? So that was your brother? Well, duh, I'm frozen here, and you're just a freaky fairy who ha who's working with a skull kid that turned me into a deco scrub, so why wouldn't I just freeze? Whee! You're the one who stayed there. Hmm? Uh, ready? Okay. Bleh. You know what? I just suddenly totally lost interest. In this part, this walk, well, this like playthrough, I'm really not interested in the what they're saying. If you have the game and you're playing through with me, you can read the read it if you want to. But that's up to you. I'm not really I don't really want to. Let's fly. We're not going to make it. Whee! We make it. No, because I don't want to, because you're a pain in the ass fairy.
I mean, hell, I've already been recording for 10 minutes, and we haven't even left that area until now. <laughs> oh, God, I got a bit of a dry throat. I need a green, but then I don't have one. Oh, well. Really? I never would have guessed. You know who that guy is? That's the guy who runs the Happy Mash Mask Shop in Ocarina of Time. <laughs> As he does in this one, but it's a traveling mask shop. Really? That's just more than creepy, dude. Seriously. First day, 72 hours remaining. <laughs> South Clock Town. <laughs> okay. I won't. Okay, bit of info as well. Because this is on the collector edition, it's going to be a little like laggy because it was transferred from the Nintendo 64 version to GameCube. You have to put up with it. Now then, we have to grab this here. This is actually a piece of the Great Fairy. Skull Kid actually broke the Great Fairy into pieces. Well, this great fairy just one piece. In every temple of this game, there's like 15 pieces of the great fairies. Okay, why am I going in this direction? I don't know. Okay, this is... West Clock Town. There are some shops here. This one here opens only up at 10 o'clock at night. This one's open whenever. And this one's like a bomb shop. This here is a bank, you can deposit your rupees. This place here is actually a betting shop, I think. Postman's house, and a swords training house. Okay then, that's all my... Available. Man, who do I think I am? A tour guide? <laughs> Okay, I want some rupees first. You can talk to this guy, his name is Triangle. He'll give you, he'll, you can buy maps from him. I'm gonna buy the map of this place later. First things first I'm gonna do before I go through the cave is this way. This actually helps you get a piece of heart. Wee! I'll explain about the piece of heart after we're done here. Cost 10 rupees. Oh, by the way, if you fall onto the floor, that's it. Game over. The only places you can land are on those platforms. Bing. 
just gotta collect the rupees and that's it, game over. Grab that one. Fly back over here. A new record! 50 rupees! Yeah, whatever. Okay, what it means by come back tomorrow is that there's, as you know, as it says, like day one, there were like literally three days. If you get three days of straight records, as in winning, but you gotta beat the records, you'll get a piece of hearts. But every other two, the two other days, you'll just get 50 rupees. Okay then, in here we go. We've got the piece, you don't have a heart attack. Oh no, it's a pyramid boob freak. I don't like these go these great fairies, they look freaky. Okay, as with magic, in the Deku form, we can uh, use magic to fire uh, things called bubble blasts. Okay then, I'll move on after I grab an item. Because you actually have to, well, it's not exactly an item, it's something you sort of have to do. Pop that balloon! What we gotta do is like a game of hide and seek. We gotta find them and then catch them. The easiest way to catch them is to use your. Well, you gotta find them before the next day, so. They'll run away if you come close to them. It's best if you do that. Stay in my line of fire, will you? Gotcha, fool. <laughs> this is one city to be used. East Clock Town. Yeah, there's east, north, south, and west. Yo, cuckoo boy! Okay. Indeed there is. Now then, up here we go! Only one left. Easy enough to get. Okay, I've been recording for 20 minutes. No problem.
I'll end this part in just a moment. Indeed I did. No way, no scrubs. Oh well. One, two, three, four, five. And the code is 43251. Let's see if I can remember that. 43... I think I've forgotten it already. Um, oh well. Thanks for watching, please comment, subscribe, and I guess I'll see you guys on part two of my playthrough, well, Legend of Zelda, um, Major's Mask playthrough. Goodbye.